Okay, this video is going to demonstrate for you downloading and installing Embrilliance Essentials. My copy of Embrilliance Essentials was bought through Embroidery.com, so I'm going to the My Design section of my account to find the download. I'll type in Embrilliance to find it. You can see here it shows the Embrilliance products that I have. I click on Essentials. The license key is kept here, and also there's a link for the download and instructions. So I'm going to click that. Here you can see there are several options for downloading a Brilliance. There's the Mac OS version and the Windows version. I'm personally going to use Windows. Pretty unique in embroidery software that Embrilliance is available for Mac. So I click Windows and the download begins. This is the only download that I'm going to need for Essentials Alpha Tricks Enthusiast and the Density Repair Kit. I would just need to add extra serial numbers if I purchase those as well. Speaking of the serial number, you can see here it's at the top of the page like it was before. I'm going to just copy that because I'm going to need it in a minute. Now my download is finished. I'll click on the zip to begin installation. Start it by clicking Run, Next. This is the license agreement. I need to read through it and accept it. Next. This is the location it's going to save my files on my computer for installation, so I click Next. This shows me where in the Start menu it's going to create a folder for Embrilliance, so I click Next. This says that it's going to create a desktop icon. I click Next. And this is a recap of those three choices that we just made for installation. And you click Install. The installation begins, and I can click to Launch in Brilliance. And here's where we enter the serial number. Remember that I pasted it from the previous page, so I'm just going to paste it now. And click Set. If I have more serial numbers, this is where I can enter them. And here I can enter my registration information. You can see here that it offers to alert me about products and updates by email. And so I'm going to enter that in my installation. It says thank you for registering. And now here's some brilliance. I can open any design file that I have. I have actually used Essentials before, so there are a few. This is how the design appears if you've been editing it and you've saved your edit file because there's more you want to do. It appears with the BE extension here in the end. This is a file that I'm ready to, to stitch. The whole design is ready, so I saved it out in my embroidery format, which is PEF. So I can go ahead and edit my design some more if I wish. and. That's what Embrilliance is for. It's for design editing, and it's a really great software for that. We'll do more on editing next time on Computer Tips.